Aussie chips, let's rank them. So we got Smith's, Smith's Originals. Mm, they're alright. They're, they're a passable chip. They're probably the nicest original chips. You get B. Grain Waves, Sour Cream and Chives. Now, this holds a very special place in my heart. So, surely... Sure, oh, see, the thing is, you have too much of them, like any more than five handfuls, and you've screwed your taste buds up for like at least the next two days. So I feel like because there's percussions on eating this chip, it, it does go to the B. Now, the Rito Supreme Cheese, now that is an S tier, that is an S tier. I eat this every day at work. If I have, if I have a lunch, I am eating this. They're the best flavored cheese chip on the market. Not sponsored, not sponsored at all. Smith's Barbecues, you know what? For a barbecue chip, it gets a pass. A C's a pass. Don't enjoy it. It's just, oh, uh, you know what? That's going to a D. I don't really like barbecue chips. Now, Smith's Chicken Chips, mmm, you get a C. It's pretty nice on bread. I will give it that, I'll give it that. But in saying that, I feel like I need to now move down my original chip choice because like, I can't even have original chips on bread. In fact, now I want to put it down a dick. Oh, I don't know. I'll leave it how it is, because Smith's original is definitely better than barbecue. But chicken, mm, it's about the same level as original for me. Now, cheese and onion, this is a solid B. This is a solid B. You know why? Because you have this on chips, you have it by yourself. It's excellent. But, it does make your breath smell like shit. So, it's not an A. Now, uh, man. I do like sweet chili. Uh, nah. Uh, this is getting a B, because just like the Grain Waves uh, sour cream and chives, they you can only have so much. Like in a small packet, it's fine, but any more than like, like I said, five handfuls, and you just, it screws up your taste buds. Now the balsamic vinegar, that's alright. I do like the taste of them. I don't like the taste of them more than the sweet chili ones though. Oh, oh actually they're, they're pretty good. They're pretty good. They can go on B as well. I would eat them. I would eat them. Now these sea salt ones, they are also B. Um, scratch what I said about Smith's original chips. Sea salt by Red Rocks. Ooh, it just has that crunch. You just bite down you're like, that is pretty good. Now Sam Boys, I'm pretty sure this is Sam Boys barbecue. Uh, I had them once in like grade 9 and I was like, uh, they are definitely a chip. I'm just gonna put it with the Smith's barbecue. It's just not bad, not good. Sam Boy salt and vinegar. Mmm, that's a pass. It, it is a chip. It's just like the most salt and vinegary chip that there is. Now kettles chili F. Now because one time I bought this thinking it was the kettle sweet chili and it wasn't. It was the chili. I don't like it by itself. I'm not. I'm not a little. I'm a little little bitch. You know, that's not me. I just. It tastes like crap. Like I can handle spice. It just tastes awful. Twisty cheese, you know what? That's a C tier. That's a C tier. Th they are nice. They are nice. Are they as good as cheese and onion and grain waves? Nah, nothing has gone to A yet. Jumpy's chicken. <laughs> Jumpy's chicken <laughs> chips <laughs> honestly taste like. They taste like just flavored polystyrene. There is nothing to them, so they're getting a D. This will hurt many Australians, but uh, come on. Let's get real. They're not good. Doritos, like taco cheese or something, nacho cheese, that's a D. <laughs> They're not good. <laughs> They're not good. <laughs> I, I will eat them. I'll eat one. I'll eat one. I'll eat them with like sour cream, but like not by itself, dear lord. Burger rings, that's an E. God damn. It's like, do you understand what you're trying to achieve? There is a flavor you need to achieve and it is not just like the burnt onion of a barbecue. <laughs> Cheezels, you get a C. They're alright. They're not, they're not great, but you can put them on your fingers and you wear them like little rings and you go, Hey mum, look, I'm married! Now Pringles, that is some A tier. That is A tier. That Pringles, sour cream and chives, that is A tier. That is the right amount of flavour. That is the right amount of flavour of sour cream you should have on your chips. Pay attention, grain waves. You could just dull it down. Just a touch, just a touch. Not much. Not much, just a touch. Pringles Originals, A tier. I'm sorry, I lied about I didn't even see the Pringles. Uh, sea salt is B tier compared to Pringles Originals. Lemon and thyme pepper, I'm pretty sure. Or like black pepper, lime and black pepper, I'm pretty sure. By Red Rocks, it's not a vibe. It, it is going with burger rings. It was, it's just the most hipster. 
It is the most hipster flavour they could have think of. They could have thought of. <laughs> and uh, I don't know who's eating this, but it's the same people that are eating avocado on toast, I think. Honey soy chicken by Red Rocks. That is pretty good. It is it is B tier. Red Rocks is just like killing it in the B tier. A Samboy Atomic Tomato. Actual, I do like this one. That is a C. That is a C tier. It, it isn't bad. I thought it was going to be awful. But you know what? It's better than the barbecue. Kettles, sweet chili, and sour cream. That is a C. The, the good, not as good as Red Rocks. Not as good as Red Rocks. You, you have something. You got something going on. It's just a bit different. They're, they're about the same, but definitely not as good. Kettles, sea salt, and vinegar. Mm, once again, C tier. It's just too like vinegary. Red Rocks, they know what they're doing. Kettle, you just, you put too much and too much is not good. Too much is not good. If I can't eat more than two handfuls, how am I meant to buy more of your products if I'm still on the same one? Now, Kettle Sea Salt, that is B. They, they did that right, you know? It's weird for me seeing a sea salt chip being better than sweet chili and sour cream because I do love it so much, but the sea salt chips are definitely a lot better than the sweet chili. Now, Twisty's Chicken, mmm, it, it's C. It's C. It's not as bad as Jumpy. Nah, it's going down to D. It's going down to D. I just, I didn't like them. Did not like them. I'd probably eat them second last. Second last in the packet. If Barbecue Smiths were there, Twisty's Chicken would be a second last. French Fries Originals, when I first came to Australia, I thought this was the bomb. But now that I've lived in Australia, uh, <laughs> you're a D. They are so salty. It's like the dude that went oil salts. Oh yeah, this meant to be like potato chips in this, right? Cheezos, cheese balls. I had them on the weekend and I got a really long shot. Like, mate, she was like two meters away and I just went, Swoop, and I got it in. I got it in. So, for the, <laughs> for the ability to fly alone, just the aerodynamics of this chip. I give it a B. Uh, Smith's Thinly Cut Originals, uh, you go see. They're alright. Thins, I know this flavour. It's like lime or something. It's just not good. It is D. It is definitely D. Someone say E. If it was me, I'd say E. Doritos Mexicana, it's the same as the nacho chips. It's not good. It's not good. It's alright. I'd eat them. Actually, no. No, no, no. I had some a week ago. This is going up to a C. It did change my perspective because I thought it was like just some weird thing with dip. But then, then I was like, what, what flavor is this? Is this CC's or something? And then, boom, Doritos, Mexicana, you're all right. Smith salt and vinegar, B, clearly. Come on, have it on bread, have it by itself. Whew, mate, it is the bomb. And now, Grain Waves, oh, what is this one? It's like tomato or something. Tomato relish or something. Grain Waves tomato relish, you get a, you get a C. I did like it, wouldn't eat it all the time. This is missing a lot of chips. This is missing a lot of chips, but I feel like this is the general what you'll find in like, <laughs> what you'll find what you'll find in most shops. So, Doritos <laughs> Cheese Supreme, you have one. You have one. Doritos, Pringles Sour Cream, and Pringles Original. You are the winners here. Everything else, pretty subpar. Uh, get out of here. You might as well stop selling it. After this video goes up, your stock's probably gonna go down anyway.